The IIAAG girls volleyball season is fast approaching and we had a chance to meet up with the defending champions to get their take on the upcoming season. Coach Bobby Kanata is confident in the team this year. Well, I expect a lot from them. Um, I have seven returnees and I'm teasing them. They're the Magnificent Seven because we're two-time champions and uh, I'm pretty confident with my team. Even though the Geckos are the defending champs, Coach Ganata concentrates on one game at a time. It depends on uh, each team. We, I don't have any tricks up my sleeve. It's just, you know, volleyball is a mind game. And we're just going to play, we're going to play one game at a time. Uh, last year's season is last year, and this is a whole new ball game for us this year. So. The Geckos are also going to be a part of the Dr. Shea Invitational Preseason Tournament, and Coach Kanata is going to use this to her advantage. Well, the Shea Tournament is going to basically tell me what's going to happen this weekend because the Shea Tournament is coming up, and I usually don't enter that tournament. It's just that's just that's just me. But the girls uh, I asked the girls if they wanted to enter it, and they said, "Okay, let's just give it a try." So. Um, the Shades Tournament is going to tell me a lot of things. It's going to tell me, basically, it's, just, it's going to tell me about my girls and what, what I need to, what I as a coach need to adjust on, need to fix before the season actually starts. One of GW's key players is Evelyn Padayo. She's a returning senior and has been playing in the Gecko squad for four years. Evelyn is happy with the season's team. Uh, I think we're going to do good. Um, so far, I like my team. I actually love my team. And, uh, yeah. Even though the Geckos have lost some returnees, Evelyn is optimistic about the season. We still have a strong team. Everybody here is young. There's still juniors and sophomores, and there's only like several seniors here. So yeah, I think we're going to do good. And they're going to do good next year, and I know they're going to do the following year. Since it is her last year, she knows the importance of defending the title. Our coach always tells us it's, it's easy to get to the top, but it's harder to stay at the top. So of course this pressure, it's always going to be pressure, especially because uh, it's my last year and stuff, so yeah. I uh, look forward to playing Academy because, you know, we've been challenging them for the championship games for the past, I don't know how many years, but I'm looking forward to playing them and ND and JFK and I guess all the teams. Another key player is junior Javina Pangalinen. It's her second year on the squad and she is confident in the ladies on her team as well. I'm pretty much confident with the team. We only lost two of our starters, I believe, and I think we still have a strong team. We have new players, they're just as strong, so pretty confident with the season. We're good, we work as a team. Um, they're, they're a great team. Even the new people, they're, they're great. The new kids on the block, they're great. Yeah, I love them. As a returnee, she feels that she has improved her playing. Last year I was a little bit too slow. This year I'm a little bit faster, so I hope that's better. I can jump a little better, block better, so yeah, I'm pretty, that's it. She knows how hard it is being the defending champions. Oh yes, I'm a lot of pressure actually, like she talks about a 3 P. I I want the 3 P, and I know these guys do also, and so we're working out to the 3 P. so kind of a lot of pressure, like she says. It's hard to stay at the top, so that's what we're working at right now. The GW Geckos girls volleyball team is geared up and ready to go this season and knows that every team is looking forward to and has the opportunity to take the crown away.